Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, so this is for January 3rd, January 3rd workout. It is cold. For those of you on the Northeast Coast, um, it looks like we're going to have some snow. So it's pretty cool. So what's today's workout? Simple. I want you to do um, 10 lunges. So that's 10 lunges each leg, um, 10 singles jump rope, then 20 lunges, 20 singles jump ropes, 30 lunges, 30 singles jump rope. 30 lunges, 30 single jump rope, 20 lunges, 20 lunges jump rope, 10 lunges, 10 single jump rope. So that means that when you do your lunges, you're going to switch legs, but you're going to go back and forth each leg. Now, what are lunges? Jump ropes, hopefully, are self explanatory. If you don't have jump rope, um, you can substitute jump ropes with uh, pretending you have a jump rope. So um, I prefer to you use a jump rope because part of this program, I want you to be a better you. And the interesting thing about jump rope, it teaches you agility. Agility is very important. Again, I want to make you the best you. So instead of you just jumping halfway, you actually have to time yourself as you get off the ground. Now, advanced levels of jump rope is a double under. In CrossFit, we do a lot of having a rope go under us twice. We're not going to do that. Um, the purpose of this program is to make you a better you. So lunges. I'm going to show you guys what a lunge is. So, lunge, you're going to stand, sorry for the pillar, and you're going to step forward, you're going to step forward, what you want to do, take one foot, step forward, make sure your back knee comes close to the floor, if it can't touch the floor, try to keep your body straight, make sure your knee is not past your toes, and you're going to come up. So, you might be able to modify this, because I have an issue with my right toe. The way you modify is just don't go as low. Just so only go as comfortable as you are. So when we do lunge walks, we actually go to the point that we're actually touching the floor and we're stepping, touching the floor and we're stepping. So uh, for you, I want you to go as low as possible to almost touching the floor. Now, like I said, the modify is just go as low as you can go. Um, some of you may have knee issues, so you may want to go like this as long as you're stepping forward. So those are lunges. You're going to count. One, one. So you're going to say one, one, two, two. So of course, that was a modified. So with the lunges, you're going to do one, one, two, two, three, three, all the way up to 10, 20, and 30. Jump ropes is singles. One, two, three, four. Again, you're going to go straight through. If you need to rest, Rest no longer than five seconds. Again, my goal in this workout is have some parameters as if you're working out with me live. So if you was work out, working out with me live, you wouldn't do 10 lunges, go off and check your Facebook and come back and do the jump rope. You know, you wouldn't do the 10 jump ropes, go off, answer the phone, and go back and do the lunges. If you was in a, a class, you would complete the workout. Rest when you need to. I'm telling you, I'm giving you a a guideline of five seconds because at least you have something to go by. If I say rest when you need to, my worry is that um, you guys are going to rest a minute, two minutes. There's a place for that, but not for my program because we're trying to get that metabolic burn. Um, some of the other popular programs, you get 30 seconds rest at a time. The most you ever rest at any time is 30 seconds, but that's through a whole complex. I'm a different type of program, so um, with a little bit different goals, all right? So lunge, 10, 20, 30. 30, 20, 10. Let's go.